The length of the driven element is not that critical, provided you've got a good impedance match with the transceiver. But parasitic elements need to be about 5% shorter for a director and 5% longer for a reflector. So I'm going to try this as a director. So driven elements normally about five, five meters long for 28 megahertz. So you need the director to be around 4.7, 4.75 meters. So just measured off three meters. That's 4.5 meters and 4.7 is about here. I'll have the bottom of the director about a metre or so above the ground. That will be a similar height to the bottom of the driven element when I'm walking along. VF. This is side on. Beaming to Darwin now and beaming over the water. down you might have heard we're now side on and now picked up again this is off the back of the beam bit of a null off the side again beaming to Darwin. Just try in the water again.
still in the water. Getting closer. I'm just um, doing some experiments with a beam. Uh, please note my signal now and I'll attempt to beam towards you on the next transmission. Yeah, VK3YE, pedestrian mobile, VK3MJ. Good afternoon, Peter. Obviously, we're working ground wave. We're working ground or like ground wave, but across the bay, my antenna, my antenna is a six foot mobile whip and running around about 100 watts. Signal 551, 51, Peter. Over. I'm approximately beaming in your direction. Has that improved the signal mark? Over. Yeah, it has slightly. I've, I've got to admit, you're not actually moving the S meter. There's nothing on the S meter at all. So your audio level did come up. Put my headphones on, which is helping a fair bit. But 100% uh, copy, Peter. And uh, it did slightly improve things. Over. Very, very interesting what you're doing there. Obviously, with the stationary director, you can move around, obviously. So uh, very, very interesting. Uh, now standing in the water, uh, well away from the uh, director, has this uh, made much of a difference? Over. Oh, it, it still sounds nice and loud. It still sounds nice and loud, but there's not, nothing on the F-meter. What I'll do... I'm the next, next over. I'll put my preamp on. I'll put my preamp on, which should give you a bit of a signal strength. And I might be able to uh, give you some, uh, some more accurate reading. Over. So with the preamp, your S-5, it's, uh, so it's made you a little bit louder. Yeah, VK3YE, VK3MJ. Yeah, a big difference, Peter, a big difference. Uh, with the preamp on, it made a difference of about two S points, from uh, S5 down to about S3. And in actual fact, I pretty much lost you. When, when you were side on, you were down in the noise. So I pretty much lost you at side on. But uh, when you were beaming back towards me, uh, nice, nice loud signal, over. There's no fade or anything like that, which I, I guess you would expect on ground wave because there's nothing really to affect the conditions, is there? Yeah, well, at, at initially, when you move backwards, when you when you were stepping backwards from the driven element, your signal is getting weaker. As your boom length <laughs> got uh, longer, and your signal got weaker. So it's better when you're uh, not too far away from the driven element. And once again, when you were side on, I actually lost you. You, you go, you, you disappear 100% when you're side on. And when you when you were in front of the director, 
Um, it was, yeah, not quite as strong. So it's always better if you're behind it. There's not a, not a great difference in signal strength, but your audio level changes a lot as you, as you move around. 500 milliwatts, over. I can just make you out. It's, uh, it's 100% copy, but it's extremely marginal. Milli- My signal would have dropped slightly, but, but not by much, over. Yeah, that's correct. It has dropped, but I can still hear you quite well. Um, so there's no doubt about it. The, the director actually does have an effect, but um, obviously you need to be you know, pretty close to within like half a wavelength or something like that. I think they're uh, over. Roger, roger. You are 5'9 and running 5 watts. 5 watts QRP. Over. Okay, great job for 5 watts and uh, 732 for the call. Thank you. No QRP. Impossible QRP. Right, it was great to work. QRP, QRP. Impossible 5 watts. I am QRP 5 watts. 73. No, no, no. 